Hello y'all, I'm working on a black bear today. I'm going to make a few short videos on scraping. Well, this step, I'm going to scrape it and salt it. I already took the feet out of it. Turn the ears. Split the lips and took the nose out. Did the other ear. Now I'm going to scrape it with a knife. I'm not going to do a video of me scraping it. But I'm going to scrape it and salt it. And then I'll show you the video. I'll make more videos of pickling, shaving, tanning like I did the javelinas. Have a good day. Then here's a video, short video of it scraped. Getting ready to salt it and let it sit overnight. And then I'll pickle it tomorrow. Have a good day. Bye. Okay, so we scraped and salted the bear yesterday. I let it sit overnight with salt on it. I just took it out and hosed it off with the garden hose to get all the excess salt off. And I'm mixing up the pickle now. It's a 12 gallon solution. Uh, 12 cups of salt. Six and a half ounces of liquid safe acid from Pro One. And I'll let it sit in there for roughly two, three days. Take it out, shave it, and then I'll put it back in overnight. And I'll do a video on a little bit of the shaving also. But here's another process done. Have a good day. Hello, everybody. I am going to shave the black bear. Here's a small video of before. And I'll show you a video after. Here's a video after shaving half the face. I don't really worry about that stuff right there because it's the inside of the lip. Most of that will be trimmed off. I got a little more trimming around the nose pad. I go all the way around the eyes. All the way around the ears. And here's what the other side look like. Then I'm going to do the whole bear. I'm going to be trimming most of this by hand. Uh, getting the fat off the pads. Getting the bones out of there. Well, the bones are all out, but all but one. And other than that, that's shaving a bear. Have a good day. Bye. Hello, everybody. We skipped a few process on the bear, but I'm going to explain them to you now. After we got it in the pickle, we took it out, we put it in tanning agent, and this time I used the Pro One Tanning Concentrate. There's a little more math with it. Tells you step by step on the back how to do it. Always make sure you write it down on this. Any time you mix up the concentrate, write it down. It's really important. So you make sure you got everything right and then you got a record of how you tanned it. So after we did that, you got to mix the concentrate with baking soda. You got to take the hides out. You mix two teaspoons per pound per five or six pounds of hide. And I can't remember the exact that I used on this, but I got it wrote down on a notepad on the bench. And today, then last night we took it out of the concentrate, the tanning agent. We let it hang up overnight, let it drip. Make sure you clip all the skin so the inside of the hide don't get exposed and dry out on you. And then the next day you just rinse it off, rub oil on it finishing oil, Pro One finishing oil. And then you roll it up and you let it sweat overnight and then you start the hang and drying process tomorrow. Uh, real important on the feet, make sure you pack these toes 
with the oil. You can see everything's oiled really, really well. But this is going to be a soft tan. If this would have been a, a bear for taxidermy, we would have went a little farther on the pads. You know, got them 100% clean. But this is a soft tan. On the lips, all that stuff gets trimmed off, so there's no need to thin it out. Really, really thin. Make sure you split the ears. Make sure you pack them ear butts full of oil. And then make sure you turn them hair side out not poked into the hide otherwise that oil there's a chance that ears could slip from moisture on the outside and a bear don't have very big ears just after it's oiled just pull that ear butt out push it down you can see the whole cartilage and everything split all the way up in there you want to make sure them ears are out because you can see right here, see how wet that is? That's where they'd slip. Oh, it even got a tip. <laughs> but on the other side, do the same thing. Reach in there and just a bear. Pretty much to me, all a bear is is a giant raccoon. But yeah, that's this process. We tanned it with the Pro 1 concentrate. Let it. I let them tan for four days on these. Usually it's only two or three, but it's a little bigger hide, so I let it tan for four days, and then I hung it up. But the next process will be, once it starts to dry, the stretch of the tan. There will probably be very little breakdown on these bear hides. I do a pretty good job of shaving them down thin enough that I don't have to break them down a whole lot. Pretty much stretch them, tumble them, and they're about done. That's about it for this part. Have a good day. Hello, everybody. I skipped uh, the breaking down on the black bear. But here's the end result.